The design changes to the Galaxy S25 Ultra, as reported by ICE Universe, signal a thoughtful evolution in Samsung's flagship lineup. Here are some key points to consider, the move towards an asymmetrical frame, with rounded edges near the back and straighter edges near the display, appears to be a strategic decision to improve ergonomics. This design could address user feedback regarding the comfort of handling the device, especially given the criticism of the Galaxy S24 Ultra's pointed edges and bulky feel. The shift towards a slimmer and potentially more comfortable in-hand experience is a welcome improvement, particularly for a device that many users will hold frequently throughout the day. Reducing the thickness of the middle frame from 8.6mm to 8.4mm might seem like a small change, but it can significantly affect the overall feel of the device. A slimmer profile not only enhances the phone's ergonomics, but also contributes to a sleeker appearance. Coupled with thinner bezels, these changes could make the Galaxy S25 Ultra more visually appealing, aligning it with current design trends favoring minimalism and sleekness. The fact that the design has been finalized well ahead of the release suggests that Samsung is confident in its approach and is likely focusing on refining the user experience. This early finalization allows for thorough testing and optimization, ensuring that the device meets high standards of quality and performance. Maintaining a flat screen design, similar to the S24 Ultra, might be seen as a conservative choice, but it ensures continuity for users who prefer this style. Flat screens often provide better usability, particularly when interacting with the edges of the display, which can be important for tasks like gaming or precise touch inputs. The Galaxy S25 Ultra seems poised to offer a balanced blend of innovation and refinement. The focus on ergonomics and aesthetics shows Samsung's responsiveness to user feedback, which is crucial for maintaining a strong presence in the highly competitive smartphone market. These subtle yet significant design tweaks could make the Galaxy S25 Ultra more appealing to a broader audience, potentially enhancing its market success. What do you think about these upcoming changes to the Galaxy S25 Ultra? Are you excited about the new design features, or do you have any concerns? Share your thoughts in the comments section below.